guys, welcome back to my channel. Thank you so much for watching. Today I have a linen closet organization video for you guys. I am so excited about this. We are finally getting my linen closet organized. It needs some serious help. There are things everywhere. I'm honestly so embarrassed to share with you guys the before. It's a hot mess. So we are going to be taking care of my linen closet in today's video. I ordered all new organization tools. I went on Amazon, of course. I ordered some beautiful acrylic bins to put all of my products in. I ordered brand new towels. I am so excited about the towels. I actually got them from Costco and they are the softest towels I've ever felt. We have literally towels to match the color of the rainbow. We have every color towel you could imagine and I just cannot deal with the mismatched towels not one more day. So we're gonna be switching out to all white towels. We're gonna be getting my acrylic bins in my linen closet. So I am just so excited about this video. Give it a thumbs up if you enjoy it. I'm gonna take you guys in my office and I'm gonna share all the organization tools that I picked up and then we are gonna get started on this makeover. I'm gonna be following the Kamari method. So I'm gonna be removing everything out of my linen closet getting it put back in so that way I can get rid of products or things that are expired and get rid of anything I don't need so let's get straight into today's video all right so here is everything we're going to be using to organize for this linen closet I ordered these bins from Amazon it came in a pack of eight they are so beautiful you guys I love the acrylic bins for organization so you can really see what you have what's in each bin so we have eight of those I'm hoping that that's enough if I have to order some more I will and then I shared this over on Instagram that I thrifted these three pieces it was honestly like the perfect timing I was thrifting at Goodwill and these three acrylic organizers had the tags on them they are by the brand I design so I'm not sure where you can find them but I got the three piece for $4.99 from Goodwill and I just washed and sanitized it so there's this little guy that's kind of like a little it said it was airtight, so I don't know what I'll put in here. And then there's this guy, which is supposed to go in a fridge, but I may use it in the linen closet or I may not. And then there's this one as well. I'm not sure if I'm gonna be able to use all these, but I'd rather have too much than not enough. And then over here, these are like some large linen totes that I got. Tammy Ferns shared this on her YouTube channel and she used it to um, store her kids toys. I loved it when I saw it on her channel. I ordered it immediately. They're just these large little like linen baskets I guess you can say. I love them. They're going to go at the bottom of my linen closet so I got two of these. I think they kind of like the shape will form when I start to add stuff to it. So we have two of these, all of these little acrylic bins, and then these ones over here. So let's get organizing. So I wanted to give you guys a run through of the before of how the linen closet is looking. It's a really big space, but I don't have it organized very well at all. We have all of my mismatched towels going on. We have shampoos and body washes and alcohol, hand sanitizer all mixed in with each other. Nothing makes sense. I can never find anything. I'm always buying two of everything. So it is finally time that we take care of it today. So we're gonna be doing the Kamari method to get this space organized. And pretty much if you're new to that, you want to take everything out of the space. You wanna get it completely cleared. I went ahead and moved my kitchen table from my dining area into this area. So that way I have a space where I can just put all of these products. I'm not having to constantly bend down on the ground. So I strongly recommend that, just pulling a table up. And then that way, once we have everything out, I can really sanitize the area. We're gonna be wiping down all of the surfaces we're going to be vacuuming underneath and getting the baseboards cleaned so that way when we reorganize everything is not only organized but it's nice and clean too
was taking everything out of the linen closet, I noticed that I had a lot of things that one, did not belong in this linen closet. I don't even know how it ended up in here. And I also noticed that I had some products, mainly medicine that was expired that I needed to get rid of. I had a lot of things of duplicates, which lets me know that I was buying stuff when I didn't need it because I couldn't see what I have. So those acrylic bins are really gonna come in handy. So that way I can see the products I have. I can check my inventory before going to the grocery store. So here is everything that was in this linen closet. I don't even know how all this stuff fed in there. It is so much stuff. Half of this stuff does not even belong inside of the linen closet, so I'm not sure why it was in there. We have all of my little mismatched towels that I'm gonna be donating because I'm gonna keep a few of them so when I give my dog a bath, he can have a towel. But other than that, we're gonna be having all new towels. Just a lot of stuff. So we're gonna be getting rid of stuff putting stuff in the correct location because I promise you most of this stuff will not be going back in the linen closet. So now I'm just going to wipe out this. Look at this down here. There was a battery that was leaking and the battery was leaking here too. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to remove that or not, but I'm gonna get everything wiped down. Just looks filthy. So let's do that and then we will start organizing. So now I'm just taking my multi-surface spray and I'm wiping down all of these little shelves. I will say that I should have lined these shelves when we first bought this house several years ago because I have ruined a lot of the shelves in this house with products. In particular, this shelf has some battery juice that leaked onto it. So pretty much a battery had exploded in here. So it had left this huge ugly stain and I tried to flip over the wood piece, but then I found one of the sides wasn't painted. So I flipped it back over in my Beyonce agreed to get that painted this weekend, but I strongly recommend you to align all of your cabinets. I'm definitely going to do that in whatever house we buy next, so that way I can keep it protected and looking new at all times. So now that I have this space nice and cleaned, I'm taking the acrylic bins and I'm really testing out how I want them. I kind of am setting them up a way that I think they're gonna be, but I do end up moving them around several times. And now I'm just taking all of the products off the kitchen table and I'm getting them organized in the bins. So right now I'm doing my hair care bin and this has all of my shampoos and conditioners. And now I'm doing my body care bin. So everything that goes on the body that's from Bath and Body Works is gonna go in this bin. I really love the fact that I got these acrylic bins because I don't have to worry about labeling anything. You can see everything you have, which is going to make it so easy when I need to find a product. Smile, what is it that you do? My life was great till you added colors. Like the moon is the snow, we don't care about the So I'm just sharing with you that container that I got from Goodwill was the perfect size to fit tampons. When I purchased that bin from Goodwill, I had no idea what I was going to put into it, but I knew that I could find a use for it. So sometimes if you guys see bins for a good deal, a good price, just pick them up and you will find a location for them. I'm actually been thrifting almost every day because I'm determined to find some more organization tools because I still need to organize underneath my bathroom sink. So. When I get all of those tools, I can definitely film a video for you guys. Now I just have a trash bag and I'm removing anything that is trash, anything that is expired. Believe it or not, we had a lot of trash that was in the linen closet and a lot of things that were expired as well. Just wanna be with you till we grow old. Just tell me you'll stay or take me away. I want you for myself every single day. Good on the weekends 
I'll be in fools drifting the deep space. In a second, I'm gonna be sharing with you guys the second organizer that I got from Goodwill, and it ended up fitting my sanitary napkins perfectly. I love that I'm able to see how many I have, so if I'm running low, I can go to the grocery store and pick some more up. Every night with you, you and me so clueless. This next organizer, I'm kind of organizing miscellaneous things. I have some sunscreen in here, some bug spray, I have some Q-tips as well, some cotton rounds, kind of things that are just like overflow of products. And then I had a whole bunch of band-aids just at the bottom of this container, so I'm getting them in a Ziploc bag, so that way they're all contained in the same location. All of these teal bins that I have, I'm gonna be donating those to Goodwill. I don't like them at all, because you can't see what products you have. For now on, I only wanna use acrylic bins. I love the way it looks number one and number two it makes things really easy so you can see all of your products So this is kind of where we're at, just giving you guys a little bit of an update. So all of this stuff that is on this table um, does not belong in the linen closet. We are gonna fold these microfiber cloths into one of these little containers, but all of this other random stuff needs to be relocated. I will put the steamer in there, but that's really it. So we're gonna be relocating all of that. And then, like I said, these towels I'm gonna be donating and then I'll save a few for my dog. And then all of this stuff does not belong in the linen closet at all. So that is gonna need to go in its correct location. But just wanted to give you guys an update. I'm gonna try to get the towels out the dryer. I think they're dry now and see if I can get those folded so I can see how it's gonna kind of come together. So now we're gonna add these totes into the linen closet. I love these so much. They are the perfect size. I did measure before I purchased them because they had like three different colors and sizes you could choose from. And these ones were the perfect size for my space. I will say that the acrylic bins that I used as well, I did measure because they came in different sizes. I think it's really important whenever you're making over a space to measure, to make sure the bin's gonna fit the way you want it. So that way you're not having to return things so strongly recommend that but what I'm using these large totes for is I'm storing my steamer in here I'm storing some extra space heaters I'm also storing some extra sheets and blankets and duvet covers so it is literally perfect to store all of those extra items and get them out the way had one leftover acrylic bin and I was determined to find a home for it so I thought it would be perfect for me to roll up my microfiber cloths to put in here I have so many microfiber cloths half of them are not even shown half of them were in the washing machine so I'm gonna get those washed and folded and put in here but pretty much I'm putting all of my cleaning cloths in my dish towels as well in here and then I have some extra attachments for my bone mop that I'm also rolling up as well So the linen closet makeover is almost done. Now I'm just clearing up my mess. I'm getting rid of all of the products that are expired. I'm also throwing away things that I no longer need. I'm adding things to a trash bag that I'm gonna be donating to Goodwill, like these picture frames on my kitchen table. I didn't have a use for those anymore, so I'm gonna be donating those. So I have the kitchen table put back in the dining room. I have everything off of the floor and put in its correct location. Now it is time to finalize this linen closet. I am just moving these bins around and I'm just kind of seeing how I want them and now I just got these towels out of the dryer they're brand new from Costco they are the softest towels I strongly recommend them they're currently on sale at Costco right now for another week they are originally $7.99 per towel but I got them for $4.99 per towel so such a steal so I am just kind of rolling the towels up just like how you find them at the hotel I wanted it to feel very luxurious so that's why I opted to roll them and not just fold them
So I intentionally saved one of the acrylic bins to organize all of my face cloths and hand towels. I got these from Costco as well. It came in a four pack. It came with two face cloths and two hand towels. And I got three sets of them. So that way I could have six face cloths and six hand towels. I am just rolling them just like the towels and I'm putting them in the acrylic bin and they look so nice in there. Okay guys, so I am taking it back down memory lane. This is the linen closet, how it started before we transformed it. It was completely unorganized. We had mismatched towels. We had all different products mixed in with each other that didn't belong. I couldn't find anything that I needed. I was buying a double of products because I couldn't see what I have. And now our linen closet is completely made over to be in a way where I could find every product that I need. I can see everything I have. Now this is the after, the space feels completely transformed. I can see everything I have. It looks like it came out of a magazine. It's beautiful. I have my white towels that reminds me of the spa. I have my cleaning cloths rolled up. I have all of my sheets at the bottom. I have my cleaning products contained in a bin. I have all of my body care in a bin. I displayed my essential oils in here. I thought that was just such a nice touch. I also brought some flowers in here for a little bit of decor, but I love Love how the space turned out. my linen closet organization. I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. I hope you got some motivation to get your linen closet organized. If you guys want to use any of the organization tools that I shared in today's video, of course it will be on my Amazon storefront. I will have that link down in the description and it's going to be under the organization tab. I hope you guys have a beautiful day and I'll see you right here in a few days with a brand new video. Bye!